This Week in Nerd History. Good afternoon, good evening, and good night. Nerd History. In what would be one of Jim Carrey's earliest forays into dramatic acting, The Truman Show released in theaters on June 5, 1998, and focused around an insurance salesman named Truman Burbank, who slowly discovers that his entire life is actually a reality TV show, and everyone he knows and loves are just actors. The story showcases a massive indoor facility so large it can house an entire metropolitan town surrounded by the ocean, and even mimics sunlight and weather conditions to a believable degree, all orchestrated by the wild imagination of the ruthlessly manipulative television producer Kristoff, the all-powerful TV god of the extreme 24-7 reality show that started at Truman's birth. Jim Carrey actually took a pay cut to stretch his drama chops, accepting a deal for $12 million when his standard paycheck was closer to $20 million. Director Peter Weir almost chose to play the role of Kristoff himself to make the movie more meta, and even had early plans to outfit all theaters showing the movie with cameras that would cut to the theater audiences halfway through the movie to make them a part of the story as well, however briefly. And while Truman's suspicions turned out to be right, there is an actual psychiatric condition where at least 18 people are documented to be convinced they are trapped living in a reality show about them. This mental condition is called the Truman Show Delusion. I'm Radio Matt. See you next time for more Nerd History.